Hey everybody, Cupid again, God of love, pet food consultant, and full-time relationship counselor for the entirety of Mount Olympus, which, who's a full-time gig? Uh, but anyway, enough about me. Let's talk about you. How do I make my cat fall in love with its food like you make people fall in love with each other? Fantastic question, and it turns out there's a lot of similarities here. What do I mean? Well, it's all about preferences. Now, what do I know is important to a cat when it comes to its food? Texture, primarily, but also flavor. So all I do is find the cat, understand what its preferences are, and then boom, give it the flavor that it wants, and especially give it the texture that it wants, and you're all done. And that's why BFF is a fantastic source for me, because BFF has a ton of flavor and texture combinations, so I know that I'm gonna find something that that cat's gonna love. Now, what about people? To be honest, it's really the same thing. You're looking to have your preferences line up. That's it. Now look, can I do the whole opposites to track thing and cram two people together who are opposites and don't get it? Can I do that? Sure. Will it work out in the long term? No. What you gotta do is put compatible people together. When I see two people with shared preferences, boom, my job's done. They can live the rest of their lives in a wonderful, fulfilling relationship. So I hope that's helped. We'll see you soon.